Well, we are back with Uncle Jay and John back in the new wreath making room. This room didn't even exist when we were here last year. It's nice and toasty warm in here. And what I love about it is if you'll notice all the wood in this room, it was actually made from trees on their property, which I think is amazing. So, um, Uncle Jay, you are the wreath making expert in the family, I understand. Well, I've been here the longest, so let's yeah. put it that way. <laughs> All right, he's going to show us how these wreaths are actually made. And again, you can special order your wreath. You can come here and buy one that they have beautifully made, or you can special order. This, Our, this is the most popular one that we make. Mm -hmm. This goes around 21 to 22 inches in width. Okay. So we're going to put on this machine over here. Okay, we're going to, these inches, we're going to cut them about 10 inches if we can. 10 inches, okay. So that's roughly about 10, right? Right. We'll go this way, we'll go this way, we'll go this way. Ooh, you're fast. I'm cut that right there. Now, I did this last year with Mary Carol. Um, it's not easy. It looks easy. It is not easy. It is not easy. Okay. I'll put it in there. Okay. There we go. That's the first oh, one. Look at that. John, thank you so much for working with us. Oh, We're so excited. You're very welcome. Welcome to the show. We missed you last year. Yes, I was, I was out in the field, I believe. <laughs> yeah. <so. laughs> well, John is working on a huge wreath that could go for maybe a bigger home or even a lot of businesses I know order from you. So this is amazing. This is what size? This is going to finish off probably about 40 to 45 inches. Great. And this is something that you'll put uh, uh, on the gable of your house or in front mm -hmm. of a business, mm -hmm. something like that with a big, nice red puffy bow. And it's something that's kind of a centerpiece to your decorating. Yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah. So it's the same concept that what I was doing with Uncle Jay, correct? Just bigger. That's correct. You use okay. a, bit, a little bit longer piece of green, probably mm -hmm. more along the lines of 15 inches or so, 16 mm -hmm. inches. Mm -hmm. And we're on a little bit different machine here. I'm not quite the, uh, I don't have the seniority, so I have to use a foot pedal. <laughs> I mean, it's just the same principle. Mm -hmm. You take the branches in your hand and you make make sure it looks nice in your hand while you're doing it. I'm going to watch you do nice. it. Mm -hmm. So you're just going to, again, just pulling the branches mm -hmm. that you had pre-cut mm -hmm. and we're setting them in there nice, nice, nice. Basically, you almost want it to look like a fan, a nice rounded edge. Mm -hmm. And we'll set it in the clip there and get our hands out of the way. You want to step on yep, it? Yeah, let's see if I can Go do ahead. this. And there you Ooh, go. Oh, you got to be pretty strong yeah. to do that. Very cool. And then uh, again, just like over there, we just move along to the next one. Love and as that. you can see, a little bit more effort, but you get the same result. Now that you know how it's made, if you got any time, stop down and help us. We can. Oh, I would love to. Them. We are so crazy booked. I would love to be here. In fact, I'm already recruiting uh, John's wife on the off season. I think she needs to join the declutter coach team. Uh, I don't know. You were very. Uh, very, very impressed with her out there, I so was. I think she made a nice fit with you guys. <laughs> she would. Well, Omar, these are beautiful. Another new item you're making this year. Tell new me about us. this. It's a, it's a garland for a fireplace. <gasps> it could be. Isn't that like a yeah. beautiful for your mantle? You, you, you use it for other things, but they look beautiful on a fireplace. Oh. I have it on my own. Oh my goodness. So the thing is, you can personalize this. You can say I'd like a gold bow or a red bow or whatever you want to do. Whatever, yeah. It's gorgeous. So if you're interested in this beautiful mantelpiece, Obviously, stop up at Masood's. But we are standing right now where people purchase already cut trees, which is amazing. It smells wonderful in here. They've got Christmas lights, and it's wonderful. But also, you can do you pick here. Tell us about that. Oh, yeah. We we, we have two uh, four-wheel drive machines. Give people <laughs> rides out in the field and bring their tree back for them. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it's so amazing. And that's very popular. It's really, as a matter of fact, they're starting to tailgate on us now. Oh! actually tailgating out in the parking lot. Well, we have had the best morning here at Masood's Tree Farm. You know, this is a busy time of year for us here at the Declutter Coach team. We've got lots of clients and get their houses ready for the holiday season. So the team's gonna go off. From all of us here at Masood's Tree Farm, from the Declutter Coach team, our team at Organization Motivation, we wish you and your family a happy and healthy holiday season. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas. Coming up next, Deb and Mary Carroll stop over at New Hartford Shopping Center for some last minute shopping.